This is Brian Hardigan for Contact TV. HMAS Gascoigne was deployed from its home port in Sydney to North Queensland recently. The mine hunter was on a mission to destroy two World War II unexploded sea mines found in the area. The rusty devices posed a potential hazard to local communities and to shipping on the Great Barrier Reef. Local divers found one device 26 nautical miles from Cooktown in about 7 metres of water. The second device was found recently on a beach on the Cape York Peninsula. Both rusty devices were destroyed in controlled explosions by Navy clearance divers. Chief Petty Officer Christian O'Neill explains the Navy's involvement. During World War II, mine laying operations took place in key choke points within Australian waters. The Navy is very committed to rendering safe and disposing of these remnants of war, not only in Australian waters, but in the whole Pacific region. HMAS Gascoigne sailed at short notice from Sydney to Cairns to coordinate with local Navy and civilian personnel to achieve uh, our required outcome. And that close working relationship, that clearance diving detachment in HMAS Cairns has with the Queensland Water Police has been a key component to effectively achieving the outcome. It's important to note that even though our mission is to dispose of the World War II buoyant mine, uh, that we need to achieve it with the absolute minimal uh, environmental impact on the reef and its, uh, its native species. Looking after our Great Barrier Reef is not only of the utmost importance to me, but also to the Navy. Okay, fire on my command. Five, four, three, two, one, fire. Right now.